56 UUM per armor piece, basically. Uh, one of them takes more than that because it takes four pieces of iridium the, plate. The quantum armor takes two stacks of fifty six or two sets. Of yeah, it's it, it, it's it's a lot of of yeah. UU matter, and so, and on top of that, I have to you know the, the diamond gates have to be finished. <clears throat> they're all running off the same power systems. So it's like you know what, this is fucking boring. It's not an interesting live stream. <clears throat> I'm going to finish that off stream, that the AFK part of it, and yeah, and and just go uh, start a new world. And that's what I'm working on now with a new world. Yeah, I've been playing around on. Um, but yeah, for all intents and purposes, I I finished it. Yeah, I've been playing around with the uh, milkers and stuff like that, and. So you're playing actually, with cows too, is what you're saying. Yep. <clears throat> but uh, I've learned enough about it, how the EMC and stuff like that works, that uh, I'm actually seriously thinking about starting the FTB map over again. Alex, uh, Lawbroken would like you to stop ignoring your TS chat. Oh. What? I'm guessing Law has tried to send you something and you're ignoring it. On TS? I don't see anything. Don't ask me. Hey, Law, if you said something on TS, I have not seen any messages from you. It must be lying, because the only person I've gotten it from is Nish and Jaded, and the only PMs that popped up. Now something popped up. We're special. Yes, I put my hand up in the air. User Good. was moved to your channel. There we go. go, all fixed. What? He wanted to be dragged. He wanted to be dragged all over your channel. But yes, so so we, we, we got Havoc to join and we didn't scare him off. Well, you know, well yeah. we'll find out if he comes back, won't we? User joins your channel. Delta, Delta said and I, and I just, I, somehow I just know that if he doesn't ever show back up again, I'm going to get blamed for this. Delta said he's ignoring you like you told him to. Uh, okay, cool. Um. <laughs> <laughs> what? Nothing. Just the, the, the way you just like, okay, whatever. Who cares? <laughs> Tell it to the hand. Hand might give a shit. <laughs> I'm sorry, but it's not exactly what I said. But you know, if that's how he wanted to take it's it, exactly okay. Exactly what you implied. If that's how he wanted to take it, okie dokie. You do too have your own room. Who? He changed it though. I have my own room. Delta has his own room. There was one up there. It used to say Delta Bites room. In the temp private rooms. Is it freaky? I'm looking up a command to use to recover my server from a backup, and the website's www.nish.com. My only person that finds that weird. What was that, sir? I was trying to remember the command to untar something, and the website that told me the information was www.nish.com. <laughs> awesome. Be right back. I have to recover Kijin. way too many files from backups. I always make backups when I'm messing, like with Forgecraft or something like that, because you never know when you're going to put something back when you're dealing with alpha builds. Yeah, I do two backups a day, and I've had to recover Miscraft ages numerous amounts of times. <laughs> you know... It's Instead of using Slowpoke's room all the time, like for this stuff, whatever, we really should create a room just for you know group, you know streamers. I don't, you know, I like usually it. use my room, but I had to keep giving the password out because you know Slow would join me, which I like, and other people would join, and then I'd end up giving the password to all sorts of people, and then they thought that they were allowed to come in all the time, and uh -huh. sometimes I like to hide in there. Meh. 
Yeah, well, that's yeah, what I'm saying. And there's this person, pass. Alex, who occasionally randomly pops in. <laughs> yeah, yeah, no, no. I, I, I popped in, and the first thing I started to say was, can I join? But you're like, oh, wait, wait, nope, nope, get out, get out. And I'm like, okay, bye, see you. Yeah. But you, you always listen to me. I don't, I don't have to worry about you thinking that I'm being insulting because I asked you to leave once. Yeah, I know. You're just like, oops, sorry. Leaving. Yep. Yeah, that was just bad timing. That point, you jumped in just as everything was sort of like stopping. She was like, "Everyone get out! Everyone get out! I want peace." Yeah, I did. I I I like to occasionally hide in there, listen to my music, sing, and uh, derp around. You know, a few people are allowed to join me for my derping and singing. The even Chrome is uh, muted. I I have had people get rip roaring yeah. ticked off because yeah. they they seem to get very offended that I'm you know not letting them in my room. Yeah, I don't know why they would. I mean, it's your room, but you know, uh, hey Delta Byte, even Chrome's uh, telling uh, tattling on you. He said Delta went to the room above me. It was Delta's cave. Yeah, but it's a temporary private, which has like no audio quality and is unbearable. Mm. Um, so, uh, go make it again. I want to see it. Why? I want to see it. I'm quite scared now. But Slow, have you, have you uh, actually looked at my, my lovely build that I'm doing? I haven't. I will uh, do now. User was moved out of your channel. I will I will very nicely turn on fly long enough for you to actually get the idea of what I'm doing. Just tell me when you're actually looking at the screen. User was moved to your channel. There you go, fixed. What is it now a permanent room? No, semi permanent. Next time the server restarts it'll go away. I'm on your... Okay, let me finish killing this creeper before he tries to take out my home. Okay, so... Why have you shot in the UFTB world? Uh, because I wanted to play with some of the new mods. Okay. Like Greg Jack, etc. And I wanted to build something other than a cave. So, oh. this is what I'm currently building. Each of the terraces is going to be a farm or factory. Awesome. Right, this is the start of the bog farm. I'm going to um, block off the water down below for a lake and waterfall effect. Has your field been plowed yet? Um, <coughs> right, but it, it, it's all going to be a giant treehouse terrace thing. What do you think, Slow? Uh, I think it'll be interesting. You hate it. Cool. No, I don't hate it. <clears throat> anyway. Yeah, so that's what that looks like. Scott wants to know how AC3 is going. But there, there, there was a lot of things that I messed up on the first world slow because I didn't understand some of the mods. So now I'm trying again. It should be cool. I, I yeah. think it's a good idea. Delta, How's AC3 yes, it... go? It's going all right. I'm going to try again in a bit. I'm not very far into it. Delta, yes, it does fix the problem with the audio quality. If you look at it, I raised it. <laughs> when is TeamSpeak getting redone? <laughs> as, as soon as the Stormbringer shows up, so we can get him to start a second server, so we can work on it. Ah, uh, you're gonna do it on a second server, and then yeah, yeah, yeah. We're gonna, gonna set best. it up on a we're gonna set it up on a second server, and as soon as that one's set up, then we'll shut down this one, then uh, just change the port number on the new one, and it'll be very, right back up. That sounds like a best plan. 
What? Well, oh, right. Okay. Jay, why do you need a room? Who? Delta Bite. Why does he actually need a room? He doesn't stream, does he? Yeah, he does. He sometimes. Yeah. Since when? Uh, for a while now. He, he occasionally yeah. streams. But I've only been doing temp private rooms, not um, permanent ones. So that the next time the server shuts down, the rooms will go away. So basically when the... Um, the server gets rebuilt, there won't be rooms already clogging up. There'll be no permanent rooms at that point. There may yeah. be two or three. Yep. The only people who will probably get permanent rooms are FTB stream team members. The people who stream every day. <clears throat> what, like me? Yeah. I, I, so I, I won't have to keep making a temporary Aww. room every single day for my 18 hour well, streams? I, I don't know if I'll do that or just create um a main FTB stream. Well, I think we, that I mean, if there's an option, I would I would think that the separate rooms for the the FTB stream team is a good idea, or subdivided rooms or something. Because well, what I would do is do like a uh, a main room for the FTB stream team, whatever for everyone. Like when we're doing this whole group thing, there, then have sub channels in those for each of the individuals. No, see what what you got to remember is I, what I want to get away from this time is permanent rooms for streamers. I want yeah, them but... to be set in temporary rooms up every time they stream. E yeah. Even those of us like me who do like 18, 19 hours of streaming well, at a time? Well, that's what I'm saying. There, but th th I'm thinking maybe we should have an exception for certain people based yeah. on the amount of time that they stream. Well, that's um, what I'm saying. Is have, have certain people that, you know, that are proven, uh, proven that they stream a lot and do it regularly could have a permanent room. But mostly just have one room for like the group thing or they can create their own temporary rooms. <sighs> just because it's just annoying. We've got 10 million rooms. Well, yeah, and I think half yeah. of these rooms aren't ever even used anymore. Exactly. Yeah, I mean, I would happily go and wipe them out. Yeah, but they do get used every now and then. Yeah. And they don't have the facilities to make temporary rooms at the moment. So that's why I've not deleted them. Well, yeah, I, I they mean, don't have if it, yeah. it, if 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 I really yo know, needed to, I could always use my team speak, um, and I wouldn't need to do the the thingy. But yo, know, I can understand the whole room thing because that it gets really annoying on any thing. I think I have like twenty rooms. I mean, on it mine. takes ten seconds to create a temporary room. Yeah, it's not that hard. Just you know, edit you know, create a new channel, and then just give it a name, and you're done. Other than maybe putting a password on if you want to keep people out. I could see it going either way. I mean, you, this is what where you say Delta Byte. You, you stream every day except for Monday and Thursday. If that's the case, you've been streaming for four weeks. He said roughly yes. Oh, hey, DeMarc. As far as I know, he's been streaming at least somewhat regularly since before yeah. I started streaming. I'm probably the newest one of the group that's doing streaming. Yeah, you I'm started the after me. I'm the oldest. I'm yeah, the oldest. this tells the original. I'm the oldest. I'm just glad I managed to get the whole streaming thing working again, but that's Slow's fault. It's always Slow's fault. <laughs> but yeah, that open mm. broadcaster is brilliant. Oh, oh, by the way, uh, Slow, yes. have you heard? Uh, Nish decided to give everyone his full name. He told everybody on Jaded Stream. Cool. Yeah, it, it, it's a really cool name. What's your full name, Nish, Tim? Nishy Wishy Yellow Squishy. What? Nishy wishy yellow squishy. So that was a load yeah, of so shit, wasn't it? Because you're doing a completely different name. <laughs> he has decided he prefers that to Nishy Poo. Yeah, both do the same thing. Oh my god, I just added a timestamp! 
I love coding. Um, I don't see it. I hate coding. <laughs> there we go. Okay. I need to make more bog, peat bog, so that this will keep producing. I mean, they probably want an automatic crafting table to do the work for me. Yeah, the one thing playing the FTB map has kind of really taught me is that I usually don't build a lot of automation just because I actually enjoy building it all myself. But if you if you really do want to do more of a time challenge on the FTB, like the Retro Insanity map, um, you would you have to do automation. No, there is no boiler under the steam engine. It's just a, a lake of water right now. Um, it's very sad. No, we do not need to support Mo Young for supporting mics and games. Voice chatting. Has anyone in this channel done any form of coding on Minecraft? Nope. Uh, yes. It depends on what you call coding. Well, coding. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like mod-wise. Yeah, I just want to see if it's possible to record when someone changes ages slash worlds. You wanted to. You just want to detect when someone. Huh? You want to detect when someone changes worlds. Basically, output to a file when someone changes worlds. Yeah, easy. Cool. I'll get one of the guys on the server to do it. Thank you. I was gonna say, uh, I'm on a channel full of coders, so. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we've had someone go into our blaze farm and break it, and so there's like a couple of thousand blazers flying around the age, blowing shit uh, up. Ah, uh huh. So I don't know who's done I it. I want to live in that age. So basically, you want to be able to find out who's done it, so you can give them a ban hammer. Pretty much. And also, it'll be nice to track if people are going into ages that are marked private. Uh, D Mark, are you in the room? Or well, in the in the chat? God. Yes. Yep, he is. Okay, Dmark, I'm going to put my specs in the chat. Would you mind coding some sort of thingy to tell the, um... They put a, like, PC spec thing and it, um, does it? Are uh, you getting tired of adding the, uh, trying to do the PC specs? When people, what is your PC running? <laughs> my PC is running really, really fast. That's why any time you try to work out its specs, it gets away from you. Obscure and funny jokes, plus one. <laughs> well, definitely got my milk thing working now. It was a bucket problem. <clears throat> uh, generally, when yeah. they say specs, all they want is the CPU, GPU, RAM, right? Probably. Yeah, yeah, basic, just the, the basic overall system. Oh. There you go. I'm not sure if he's actually in the team speak. Is he? Just uh, put that in some sort of thing so that, that people can type, like, yo, I don't know, exclamation PC specs or something. Uh, you put it in team. Oh, no, that was Nish. Never mind. Nish is doing something. Yeah, I did. I was like, what the heck? So you said put that in, and I said pop, 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 pop. I was like, what was that? <laughs> And before people get in a dick measuring contest, I actually don't care what your computer specs are. I don't. I'm a girl. And I'm enough of a girly girl that I don't give a flying fuck. <laughs> Does it run? Does it run Minecraft? User joined your channel. Can you do what you want to do with it? Yes? Good? Great. Goodbye. <laughs> Uh, 
Uh, yes, it is a lot of RAM. I plan to add more because you can never have too much RAM. I'm not angry. Oh. Ask any oh. of my regulars. This is not me angry. I would have gotten 32 gigabytes of RAM for my PC when I bought it, except for the 32 gig RAM chips cost almost as much as uh, my computer did. I don't have two terabytes of RAM. I have a two terabyte hard drive and a three terabyte yeah. external hard drive. I like to have space for all of the millions of backups I make. I mean, y'all think that, you know, you guys might make too many backups. I, um, I, I make a backup of my whole computer every day <laughs> and then backups every time I change Minecraft. <laughs> yeah, I don't back up my com whole computer every day, but uh, I do regular backups. But oh, I back it's not up like everything. I'll, yeah, it's not like I'll run out of space, though. I only have seven terabytes of hard drive space. Oh, so you've got two terabytes more than me. What was I going to make? I was going to make something. Oh, I remember. I was going to make an automatic crafting table thing, except then I actually have to put, like, what did it? Project tables are part of Red Power? Or EE. I'm assuming it's not something I can make. Redper. Project table to Redper. Yeah, Jacob, yeah. You think you think that was a lot of sp suddenly two terabytes doesn't sound like much once you discover recording and streaming and stuff. Yep. <laughs> uh, now, Ramar, I don't have a lot of money. I'm on a fixed income. And I'm disabled. What I am good at is finding sales and getting discounts. And my entire computer cost me four hundred and fifty dollars. You don't need a lot of money to get a computer. You just got to do yeah. it right. Yep. You just have to one know how to find sales, and two be willing to put it together yourself. Yep, and be patient because just because you you see something there, and uh, sometimes if you know how to watch the system, whatever, just because it looks like it's on sale now doesn't mean the price actually won't drop a little bit later. That's kind of what happened to me. I, I spent the money on mine, and then three months later, um, about half the components I bought for mine, I could have gotten an extra 25% off. Well, I got most of mine between 50 and 70% off. I got mine at about uh, 35, 40% off on most of my parts. The only thing I didn't get any discount on is my... Uh, the case, the chassis that I got for my computer. Yeah, I, the 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 case was like uh, sixty bucks, um, and that wasn't well, on sale. But yeah, mine mine cost me two hundred and fifty. Something worthy of note. Two and a half weeks from today, the Hobbit comes out. Woohoo! Yay! Mm. Oh. Woohoo! Yay. What do you mean, woohoo? Shut up, you. Be totally enthusiastic. Yes! Oh. Out of my ears. You should have so, orgasms at this film. Oh! Oh! Ooh. Ah. Yeah, you, said, yeah, yeah, you said you're supposed to have Happy. orgasms. You, you, you're, <laughs> you said you're supposed to have orgasms because his little hobbit's coming out. Oh, that's <laughs> amazing. <laughs> I had somebody daft enough to ask me, why is this 18 plus? You're plus playing Minecraft. This is why. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. G-Mark's like, well, that just suddenly escalated to 18 plus. Yep. <laughs> G-Mark, you've been around. It's not like you're, you're in shock that it went 18 plus. No, no, no. Slow isn't a hobbit, but he has a really nice little hobbit. I didn't. I didn't make. I did not squeal that loud, Titani. <laughs> the stream of jaded cat where we go from talking about the Hobbit to blow jobs, cocks up and flipping on one <laughs> in the space of a minute, and we wonder why in the risky folder that has one streamer in it. <laughs> I am never going to live that down, am I? No. Unfortunately, Slow, she's not the only one in it. We're all in it now because we stream at the same time. And in the same yeah. room. Like, yeah, yeah, in the same room. <coughs> yeah. You know, with... You the, know, come on, those of you who were there for the, the release of FTB, yeah. the FTB launcher know that that was a mild squeal by my standard. Yeah, 
I was going to say is that, you know, since Havoc now knows that we're all part of the FTB team, whatever, maybe they're just going to relabel it from the Jaded Cat Risky uh, streamer folder to the FTB Risky streamer folder. Yeah, I just, you know, the, uh, uh, no. <laughs> I think they should rename it to Slowpoke folder. Slowpoke is entirely at fault for me, guys. If you ever wonder who's to blame for me, it's Slowpoke. They're playing me. They, they can rename Hun, you're the one who said, hey, Jaded, you're out of stream. Yeah. yeah I think not show you out to be be my brothels. Uh, I don't know what's going on. <laughs> Honey, you said be Honey. myself. Am I not being me? You would prefer what? I discuss nuclear physics? Yes. How interesting yes. would that conversation be? Well, first she gets really hot. And then I take a cold shower. And produce lots of steam. Gets really steamy. It's very wet and moist. And warm and damp. <laughs> and, and then... <laughs> 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 yes, D-Mark. Oi. Oi. We have children in the channel. Um, if we have children in the channel, they're about to get their asses banned. Yeah, but you're, you go remember, you're not the only person streaming. Um, I can go to my own room. That's fine. If you want me to leave, <laughs> I, I can leave. No, don't leave. I'm going to eat lunch. <laughs> no, lunch. Oh, no. Uh -huh. Yeah, I mean, we were talking about his little hobbit earlier, and then he said something about eating lunch. I was trying, yeah. What was that? I'm, my feelings are hurt again. No, they're not. No, they're not. Yeah, yeah. No, they're really not. You're right. Uh, chances of my, my feelings being hurt by something like that, rather slim. It's very hard to hurt something that doesn't exist. You have no feelings. You are just ice. You are the ice queen. Mm-hmm. He has feelings. They're just a little, um... Go on. Hard-edged. <laughs> you just got a little quiet now. Mm-hmm. Yeah, Why? Yeah, you, have to, you have to rub her feelings right to make them all nice and smooth. Oh. User was moved to your channel. <laughs> hey, D-Mark. Would you like me to stroke your feelings for you, Jamie? No, thanks. I'm good. Are you sure? Yeah. Okay. User was moved what to the channel. Hello. You want am I making? Hello. Yeah. Boggers. Oh, okay. The next time someone speaks to St. X Comp Wiz, may you please let him know I'd like to converse with him. Uh, let's this. see. Who is fuck this? You? And where's this town? <laughs> <laughs> the fuck is wrong with you, dude? Calclavia! Hi, Calclavia! Where's Calclavia? In the room, right below you. In this room. Oh, right below the slow. Good place. I'm, I'm getting moaned at because there's no server side to your pack. Uh, and, and I, as in answer to your question about whether I've tried the mod pack out or not, uh, no. So it's a bit more techy than I really care for. Um, there's some of the mods that I'm planning to steal and add to my group, but the whole thing as a whole is a bit more sci-fi techy than I play. <laughs> it looks cool, mm. but I want magic. I went dragons, and magic, and farming. Oh, farm crafting. A lot of crafting. Things. And pretty things, not blocks of you know machines and more machines. I have enough machines. <clears throat> machines can be fun. I don't have to go back to bed. What's wrong with you, Delta Bike?
You're saying oi. This texture pack basically is an example of what you can do with Photoshop or Paint and a couple of your favorite texture packs. Move the textures. Back in an hour, so I'm going to go get some breakfast in my... Enjoy. Ah. Buddy left your channel. You're going to need that many carrots? They're free food. It tastes easy. Munch, munch, munch. <clears throat> no, no bronies. I will cut little ponies up into tiny, tiny bits with a chainsaw. Brony brunch. The greatest meal in the world. Would you like me to kill you now or later? <laughs> well, this... It, it, you know, that would be the third time you said you're going to kill me, you know. And to remind you of it. Okay, let's see here. I need... Let's see, what's the minor take? Oh. <coughs> and you didn't replant your carrot, by the way. Don't care. Okay. I have a whole other field of that. The mining well just digs one down, right? Mining well will dig one spot down, depending on... That's the IC2 one, right? Mm-hmm. IC2, I if think. You, or I maybe this, No, this is Buildcraft, I believe. There's one oh, by one. Then the miner is bigger depending on what uh, parts I put in it, right? Yeah. The mining well is straight down. Nothing else beside it, just straight down. Yeah, because I am going to need... Um, some more ores. I'm not 100% sure I really want to go mining for them. So it might be best if I take a look into the idea of... As I say, if you don't want to create a giant hole or have to plant a whole bunch of them, the IC2 miner can get you a decent amount of ores. But it takes some setup to get it working. Um, I'd need to go get some diamonds to do the turtle. You have our... Well, no, you probably don't. I was going to say, after you have RP installed. I don't have RP. That's what I said. You, you probably you, you don't. Keep thinking, like, Do you, you keep thinking Forgecraft here. I know. I'm not on I'm Forgecraft. Spoiled. I'm spoiled. I have some of the... Well, I have I have Zycraft, um, but that's it for the Forgecraft mods that I have. What, you don't have Railcraft and you don't have... Well, uh, I meant... You, you know what I mean. <laughs> No, I was getting. Uh, no, the reason I was saying RP is because they actually have it set up so you can actually make the gym tools to uh, make turtles, but not. Uh... Yeah, a lot of people can't wait for certain things to be done. <clears throat> I just have the world gen for uh, 1.4.2 for Vicraft. <clears throat> Elorum is busy with work. What's the difference between burned to death and went up in flames? In terms of Minecraft deaths. Burned to death... I think it's when you... And went up in flames. Yeah, I said burned to death, I uh, think is when no, you... No, Zycraft was not released to the public for 1.4.2. I will not give it away. Yeah. If, if Soren wants people to have it, he will post it. Burned to death is when you're on fire and die from the fire tick. When, uh, sorry went up in flames is that burned to death as if you're standing in something that causes fire damage that kills you. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Burned to death, I think, so when you're in lava or standing on an actual patch of fire, 
the went up in flames is when you were just lit on fire and the and you I, didn't put yourself out and die. It's it's not your fault. There's nothing wrong with Athy. I'm just saying, you know, I I can't give you something that you know Thorin gave me and didn't tell me I should give it away. I, I just can't do that. Um, I no one's been able to like I said, Elorum is at uh, work. She's got a jo- she has the job that she's been doing. And so uh, we don't know if she's had a chance to even find out, know, know that her site's down. She's, uh, my understanding is she started a new job on Monday, so she's just been busy. And I'm, I'm, and I'm not saying that Soren would mind, but you guys are going to have to ask him. I'm going to need to make generators, etc., etc. soon, so I need even more ores. It is a new world. New world, new map, whatever you want to call it. It is new. Later, Delta Byte. User left your channel. Um, not technically. The only thing that isn't currently in the world or wise that you would need for red power is Nicolite. And you can get Nicolite through the use of Mythcraft, among other things. Um, it, it's not like you can't get Nicolite um, in other ways. Um, Greg Tech adds all of the gems, um, and, I'm sorry, but you don't actually need marble or basalt to move along in the RP2, um, progression. Yeah, basalt and marble are strictly an aesthetic, almost strictly an aesthetic block. Yeah, so, well, yeah, they're nice. You can get them by doing, um, a simple miscraft world gen. If equivalent exchange is installed, you'll be able to equivalent exchange between those blocks, by the way. Yeah. The needed ores are already available in the world. Silver, um, copper, tin, etc., etc., whatever else is needed for red power. It, it's all in the world. Um, so, at, at most, you have to go to a new Mistcraft world to get Nicolite. You don't need to link Zycraft's site. You can probably just search, look for Zycraft and Minecraft and Google search. You'll probably find it for you. Yeah, and you might end up with some weird-ass um, volcano generation or whatever with, you know, stuff generating differently than you were expecting, but hmm. nothing that's going to be game-changing. <clears throat> that gravel almost got you. Um, no, I turned off Twilight Forest, guys. What is that? I keep hearing people talk about that mod. Basically, it's a magic mod. Oh, it okay. won't be in the final main pack. It'll be in the Magic World pack. Okay. Just like Thomcraft. Thomcraft is kind of cool. I really should do some more research on that one. I can't wait for the Magic World one. I, I'm I'm looking forward to that one. That's probably the one pack I'm most looking forward to. Sorry, Calclavia. I like magic. Not tech. <laughs> magic. <clears throat> when you said tech and magic, it made me think of uh, the Babylon 5 series and the Techno Mages. Techno Magery, I could do, but. Um, I understand the main pack. Y'all are thinking about the main pack as something for you to play. 
The main pack is going to be the pack that is used to create the FTB maps. So you're not going to have some of the mods in that. You can always do what I did on my live stream earlier and move mods around. Like, I'm going to be stealing a couple mods from a Calclavius pack. I think it was the uh, factory or assembly line or something like that. And Factorization? No. It was like assembly line or something like that. Oh. Honestly, Cal, can you, can you talk at all? Or is your mic broken? You're at work? What? Yes, I can. Okay, please do, because I, I have some questions for you that were brought up yesterday when I was looking at which pack I wanted to start this new world with. And since you are here and kind of a captive audience... Captive. <laughs> a mega pack with all mods. Hmm. Uh, the why you know makes some uh, good world mod is the mod that makes the void world for um, FTB. So if you're trying to use that mod pack with a different world, that's the one you need to use. You need to get rid of. Yeah. <clears throat> Hello. Hello, hey. Calclavia. It's lovely to have you join us for a question and answer session. All right. <laughs> you have released a third-party mod pack. It is now time for your torture by fire. All right. Okay. Put candle back up, by the way. I did. You know that assembly line you need universal electricity for it to run, right? I, I figured as much. Um, yes. That you, so you need the core to make any like of them run. Yeah, if you don't like tech mods, it's kind of like installing that thing, but you have nothing to power it. And well, I thought I'd just use it as pretty blocks, honestly, you know? Oh, okay. <laughs> you mean, well, you mean, you mean kind of like Zycraft? No, no, I'm kidding. I... I <laughs> I figured pretty quickly that I'd need to install the universal core mod um, to, yeah. to, to get the energy. But why don't you explain to me, because um, admittedly I sometimes lose the gist of things in writing, what is the point of universal electricity? Kind of like, uh, I'm trying, like, when I actually came to Minecraft very late, I came, found Minecraft 1.205, and then I started playing mods, and all these different mods, each of them have their own electricity, or own energy source. Like, a lot of mods have that. So I was kind of annoyed from that. And that's like one reason. That's like one reason. Um, so I made this API that's kind of like, anyone can use it. It's uh, open source and stuff like that. And I know Buildcraft already has an API for energy, but their energy is unrealistic. Like, it doesn't use the... I wanted to make a, a mod that uses the real-life units. Power. So, uh, so that's why I made universal electricity uh, because it's, it, you know, it's not like Bowcraft. Bowcraft is, is a mod plus an API, but universal electricity is just an API, kind of like Forge, where you don't add content to the game. Okay. So any mod can just implement the API, and then they will be compatible with uh, uh, all other universal electricity. Mods. Okay. Yeah. So, now, does that mean only ones that are coded for universal electricity will work, or are there ways yes, to, like, like convert uh, buildcraft? Like rail, railcraft is uh, coded for... Talk with uh, Agor for that. MFFS mod is uh, working with universal electricity. Actually, yeah, it's working actually pretty well. It uses the recipes I made also. And uh, we're getting more... I'm trying to get more and more people to use it. So it's kind of, so it's more universal. You know what I mean? Well, I get what you mean. Yeah, that was the, the main thing, is it seems like, um, it, no offense intended, but it, it seems like yet another mod that adds yet more solar panels. And, and, and more... I didn't make the solar panels. I, 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 I did, it's yeah. It's up to everybody else to make <laughs> I just I just wrote the framework. I, I, I really liked the idea of the, the universal electricity, but then some of the mods... Um, yeah, I know. It's repetitive. A bit repetitive. It, it's like, okay, if I add these in, how many... I, there are really only so many different types of solar panels I need in a world. No, no, no. You need them all. 
No, no, you have to I need all. an array of every kind of sun power possible. Okay. Yes. Uh, yes. Did you see the well? Do you see the uh, mod mechanism, right? Do you see that mod? Well, I saw I saw it, but I was very confused by what it was. It wasn't very. Um... Yes. Uh, the the mod maker of that. You, you, one thing you have to know is that universal electric is pretty new compared to auto tech mods, so you cannot compare the bug uh, bugginess quality to other people because. We only started for uh, started like in in the summer, so mods have only been, and some mods have just started like a few months ago. So there are, a lot of mods are kind of in dev type. Uh, so mechanism. It, it, it seems that some of them didn't seem quite fully finished. Yeah, exactly. So a lot of mods are in dev. So the currently the finished mods, or at least have a release. Are the ones in the pack right now, and there are like six other mods that are like in dev, and you don't have that many developers to make it very fast. We have like about eight developers currently, uh, maybe ten if I count Cobra Jaguar, but he's kind of like uh, doing it on the side. Uh, so basically, we're trying to make. Uh, well, I'm encouraging people to uh, write more mods for this, and you know, there are a lot of small modders out there that aren't that famous, you know. So, and they want to make tech mods, but then they don't really want to use the, uh, they don't really want to be dependent on IC2, because when you make an IC2 add-on, you have to install IC2 to, to have your add-on work, you know that. So, uh, if you implement universal electricity, your mod can work without any other mod. Uh, it basically works, uh, works uh, independently. Okay, well, um, again, play, playing devil's advocate, as, as usual. Yeah, I'm the evil one. Why should I install those over IC2, etc.? I mean, yeah, they 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 use their the they all of the mods can use the same energy type, etc. But if I install those at the same time as some of the other ones that I I like and enjoy playing with, um, for some definition of like and enjoy playing with, you know, I've now got four types of power in the world. <laughs> how how many types of power can I conceivably need? Is there is there any chance of a mod part of universal electricity that would make an engine that could convert or block, that could convert between the types? Actually, the battery box in universal electricity is natively compatible. That means you can plug in IC2 wires into that thing. What about buildcraft or, uh, pipes? Yeah, or buildcraft stuff. I think I wrote that in the website. So I could I could plug everything into yeah. that that battery and I, well I aim to add in more actually I it's, it's compatible with buildcraft and industrial craft right now because those are the biggest yeah those are the main odds. ones yeah those are and and there's no way I can do uh, uh, red power because LRM doesn't like it um uh, red power compat already converts to I know I, it's compatible so. with buildcraft so you had to convert to buildcraft and then convert it to universal electric so double conversion. And, and, and yes, guys, I have questions because, you know, we were looking at the mod yesterday when we were looking at what I was going to start the new world as, and there were some questions I had about the mod. And you know, who better to answer it than the mod creator and the mod pack designer? Right? Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, okay. And he so made the mistake you, of wandering in me. here. <laughs> oh, just now you asked me why you want to use this uh, over IC2. Well, for currently, at this stage, we don't have enough content to say that we're better than IC2 yet, okay? But eventually, we will have enough uh, stuff. Currently, we have, like, uh, almost uh, all the primary stuff IC2 has, like, uh, you know, the macerator. And then our version of those things are actually, like, they're not exactly the same. You cannot say we, we're copying them. We are improving on what they already have. <laughs> A lot of mods have done that. Look, yeah, it's kind of like... Uh, Wait, how do I say it? Uh, have you seen my nuclear reactors? I hate nuclear reactors. <laughs> well, the point is, uh, because I, I really, I, I have no offense to the IC2 team, but I don't like their nuclear reactors. The way it's like, it's just one block, and, mm. you know, <clears throat> in, in real life, a nuclear reactor is not one meter big. And I know this is Minecraft, but I'm trying to... Uh, you see, that's, said, but that, that's one of those things that I, I'm, I'm not overly fond of, and it's, it's probably just my very odd personality, but I don't actually particularly care for giant multi-block machines. I, I like smaller things. 
compact, tidy. No, uh, personal preference, but you know, I really like the fact, that, like, I like Railcraft in a way that a lot of stuff has to be built, and it's not just like. Well, that's one not a very nice block. comment, lighter. Yeah, uh, that's why, like, that's why I really like Railcraft. You, you see, it's uh, the oh, the oven. I forgot the exact name, but you can. It's like built from different bricks. Pretty cool, and you see the iron tanks. Well, one of uh, my one of my chat members would like to know why you released it before it's better than IC2. This is called beta stage. Ah, so this is a beta build, so we can test it out and then go whine on their website about what we don't like yes, and what they should change. To all the all the UE modders in IRC, and then to make them work better, because they they kind of uh, a lot of the modders in Universal Electric are a bit low, so because they're not all experienced <coughs> guys. Yeah, Dyer even let me change the config settings so that the uh, IC2 reactor on Forgecraft now uh, only ge it generates steam, so now we have to go and add a turbine to it. Or several turbines. Um, uh, you, oh, you mean, you mean the... Oh, well, I no, it, it was more that it wasn't... You know, I understood what you were asking, but it wasn't phrased in the nicest possible manner. But that's okay. I can rephrase for diplomacy. I'm good at this. I have to rephrase yeah. what I want to say all the time. And Calcolivia, yes, there is a setting in there to uh, change it so that the nuclear reactor produces steam. Oh, that's cool. So you just plug, like, uh, plug uh, Billcraft pipes in? Or, how, like, how do you get steam out? Is it is it Railcraft steam? Uh, Railcraft does steam for the steam. T uh, like I said, you'd have to add Railcraft turbines to uh, power it or oh, okay. use the Railcraft steam. Oh, well, that's fair enough. Or... As long as you didn't mean it that way. That's pretty cool. Yep, he said it, he said it would be fun to kind of play with because he already set it up to use uh, EU, but he said that when he got back from vacation, he said fun something fun to play with, figure out how yeah. to hook it up to the turbines and stuff. Yeah. Hmm. As far as I know, no, there is no way to teleport IC2 power. That would be old. Oh. Enough. Well, actually, we are Buildcraft, to, yes. We have a plan to make uh, this thing called electricity. It will be a UE mod that does that. It's like energy teleportation, but uh, it costs... Tin, and unfortunately I don't have any. <clears throat> you can transmit IC2 power by converting it to the modular force field system force power. Good night, everyone. Oh, and, and Good night, sleep well. Yep. The IC2, User, if you use Forcium, you can channel. actually generate IC2 power, so... And Force power is transmittable between the capacitors and stuff like that, so if you transfer it oh, into, yeah. IC, into MFFS, then transmit it, and then you convert it back. Oh, that's like an infinite distance teleport. Uh, no, I think it has... I, I'm not sure, I, I think there's a limit, right? Yeah, capa the, cap the MFFS capacitors have a range. You have to put range upgrades in them. I don't know what okay. the max is. Yeah. I specifically talked to uh, Thunderdark to make sure I can my EMPs can fry his. Yeah. Uh, oh, um, Greg, Greg Tech does add a way for doing IC2 power, I believe, on doing its uh, super storage blocks or whatever the hell they are. Yeah, yeah the uh, this Ender storage, uh, Ender Energy storage. Yeah, something. I've never played with Greg Tech, so. I saw a video on it, and I was like, hmm. I saw his fusion reactor also. It's small. <laughs> like, uh... Box or something. Um... Calcleria. Yeah? Um, I was, um... You know, I was meaning to ask, is there any more, um... Tutorials you want me to do now? Oh. Uh... Maybe, yeah, maybe you could do uh, the tutorial in the Fusion Reactor. Uh, I don't right, think... I'll I have uh, these guys aren't the, aren't the Greg Tech people, guys. Uh, isn't the Quantum Generator Greg Tech? Yeah, it is. Yeah, this is not this is not the Greg Tech person. This is Universal Electricity, the newest no, no, uh, third-party mod pack. my Fusion Reactor. Wait, what? Huh? Right, he's talking about my Fusion Reactor from my Atomic Science mod. Oh, that one! I looked at that and went, oh my god, fuck no. Purple one. 
the, the purple plaza. And, and, and not in a bad way. It was, oh, holy shit, this is going to kill my brain. No. Yeah, I, I put a lost signs thing in because... Yeah, I, yeah, I noticed. No, yeah. no, 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 no. So, no. It, yeah, if you don't like tech mods, you probably don't like my mods. I think your mod is very well designed and quite nifty, but um, it's frightening and no. No, 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 no. <laughs> Wouldn't it just be easier to say, hell no? No, I like saying no, 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 no. No's the new yes, you know. Yeah, then why, do you, why would you want assembly line inside? Uh, because I, I, I thought conveyor belts would be fun for my sorting system. I don't know if you've watched my live streams. I have this thing with sorting systems. I have oh, an okay. affair with sorting systems. Yeah, okay, that means I have to work more on assembly line. I, I, I need so sorting system stuff? My code dev is not working. Wait, so you mean that it, you know, that mod that I went to install doesn't work? Is that what you're telling what? me? Are you telling me what? that it doesn't work? No, it works, but uh, it's not complete. It's uh, assembly line is kind of in alpha stage, so... Okay, it, now it, I'm, I'm, I am going to have to get on you about this one. Why would you put an alpha stage mod in the mod pack? Well, it's alpha because there's not enough content, I call it. But it's actually, it doesn't crash or anything. But it's but alpha. It won't, it won't crash your game. It just doesn't have that much content. That's why I consider it alpha. Okay, well... As, as I, well, I, I have pretty high standards for uh, 1.0, so... Okay, just, you know... Was it saying it was a bad thing? Just, you know, why would you put and an alpha mod in? Pack is, is kind of like a beta pack, because no universal electricity mod... Well, maybe Railcraft and MFSS, but not all of the mods are 100% done. He just is wanted he... to sneak it in. Well, yeah, I pre yeah, yeah. you know, I prefer to uh, do beta releases rather now, than... Why, why isn't NEI showing the recipes yet, they would like to know. Uh, is the plugin not been written for NEI? Uh, no. There's no plugin yet. Yeah, asking general Minecraft questions will not get you any help. Um, this is a guy who does, you know, Universal Electricity, the new mod pack for FTB. Um, you can download it. If you like really, really techie mods, you like the sci-fi thing, this could be the mod pack for you. I it's think it should really be renamed awesome. from Universal Electricity to SciTech Mod, but... And or Oh God Missiles Mod. That works too. If you want ICBMs, this is the mod for you. You want to blow shit up, this is the mod pack for you. <laughs> yeah, it is. <laughs> um, Logo would like you to know the mod pack is awesome. Woohoo! Another TC update! Oh, wait. That's teasing you all. You're so mean. God damn it. <laughs> you know, that would be the one reason I would want on Forgecraft, so that I could play with Thomcraft. <laughs> <laughs> you know, for, for, for all that I would not want to break things on the server, I would want to be able to play with Thomcraft. <laughs> Is that horrible of me? User joined your channel. You are very mean, uh, just saying. Well, Craft, when now? Let me cry. Well, see, Red Power, the latest version. Thumbcraft, the latest version. Am I, I just, teasing you still? I, I just want Thumbcraft. Uh, I just Alex want Thumbcraft! I, 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 Alex? Alex? Yeah? I want the chest that goes... Nom 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 but yeah, um, Carl Olivia. Yeah? I will eventually learn to pronounce your name right, and also, so, you want me to do a fusion reactor to... Your pronunciation's already, uh, not bad. I uh, can't stop uh, teasing. Jaded says I'm a tease. You are a tease. <laughs> <laughs> Who says you're not? Is somebody you're trying not... to claim you're not a tease? Cause, um... No, no, they told me to stop teasing.
That's kind of all Alex does. It's really all she knows how to do. <laughs> if she were to stop, we'd have problems. She'd be all bored and mopey and... But, yeah. That, that would be the one thing I would want to Unforgecraft for, is, is Thomcraft. Yeah, you like magic mods, right? Yep. I love magic mods. As long as they add something. I, I don't want just, oh, look, some more mob, mobs, and hey, look, <laughs> yo, like mo creatures. junk. Yeah, yeah, no, no mo creatures. Not a fan. I realize a lot of you people really like it. Um, it can get really annoying. Mean, this mean is item. this is known as mining by creeper. Wait, what? What I just mining, did? Mining Shit. by creeper. <laughs> right. And that's known as falling down the ladder that you forgot you put in place. <laughs> also, um, Alex. What? Was it you with the glowing ways of bees? What was that? The glowing walkway of beehives. Yes, yes, I'm the one that built everything out of bees until I could get a cobble gin going. <laughs> How's that going? Good. <laughs> I've removed most of the beehives. No, you usually kept them, just just with why not. Well, I didn't keep them because I kept getting reports that uh, there was glitching where you can fall through them to your death. Yeah, like I did. <laughs> I, I, I fell through the one and, and died a horrible, horrible death. Lost my pea stone and everything. What you should do is start putting things out of uh, av aviaries. Because that would just be hilarious. <laughs> You're going to need a lot of stuff, but it'll be worth it. I uh, wouldn't need a whole lot of stuff because uh, I've got several milkers running now. I've been playing around with milkers lately, so I have lots and lots of EMC. Yeah, because you freaking EE, -E, goddamn. <laughs> And, and, and Kelkay, Clavia, thank you very much for answering all my obnoxious questions. I appreciate it. Kalkalavia, we love. <laughs> Don't put words in my mouth. You want to even put no. something else in your mouth? That would be nice. <laughs> <laughs> the silence. <laughs> Uh, uh, I'm breathe. I'm breathe. <laughs> <laughs> and if okay. you didn't expect okay. this coming into this channel, shame on you. <laughs> no, I expected it perfectly. I've been in this channel once once before, and remember my um, my uh, reaction to the um, to the upcoming uh, walkway of beehives. Um, uh, sure. Sure, why? Sure, why not? <laughs> yeah, no, I, uh... Muggs is the one that gave me that idea originally. It says, you know, you got lots of beehives. I was like, oh, and they provide light, too! And so I started building whole <laughs> platforms out of beehives. I'm, Actually, I'm I... just now thinking about... Go on, go Goodbye, on. Max Urge! It I was nice have... to meet you. It's too bad you're an idiot. I still have, uh, around the, uh, nether portal, um, where you yeah, go into the gone. nether on the map, the entire platform down there is made, the floor is made of beehives, it's double thick, though. Please start making just walls out of nuclear reactors, that would just make my day. <laughs> so that's where the zombie like, villagers got herself off to. It's like, in, like, in just slotting nuclear reactors. And have them all powered, so, so just, like, generating... Thousands, thousands, and thousands of EU. That that's very safe. Yeah. No, no. All, all of nuclear incredible. reactors, all of nuclear reactors, you know, set really low so they don't produce a whole lot of EU, or whatever, so they won't explode. But have yeah. uh, have Tesla coils outside connected to each one of them. I mean, whoever <laughs> who, whoever stays there is gonna get so much cancer. <laughs> uh. Um, I am now just thinking of the most ridiculous blocks to build houses out of. Ra rough lamps. 
Oh, you have no idea how many of those I've built. My Make new build a room is made of them. I haven't I haven't gone that bad, but I have my uh, tower that I'm building on Forgecraft. Uh, the base of I finished the base of it so far. Um, just the first room type thing. The first room is 20 blocks tall on the inside, and it is nine chunks by nine chunks wide, but it's an octagon shape, so the corners are cut. Um, I've lit the entire thing up with wrath, nothing but wrath lamps. I had to build. I had to make <laughs> over 300 wrath lamps. Oh wow! Wait, what is this room used for? The room that I'm building in the my tower that I just explained. <laughs> Yeah, that's the ba that's the base of my tower. It's gonna be my factory floor. It's nine chunks, nine chunks. Nine chunks by nine chunks. One hundred and forty-four blocks across. You either have too many materials or too much time. I think it's a mixture of both. Yeah, it's a little mixture of both. <laughs> well, guys, I think I am actually gonna call it a night for the stream and go take a nap. Why are you saying that? Because oh. you're only calling it a night. You should call it something else. Anyway, um, I'm very tired <laughs> and kind of sleepy, and I am going to head off. I will probably be back on again later tonight. Um, okay. After I've gotten a nap. We know you'll be back on later tonight. And then I will, I will see now. you all then. Um... Okay. Channel switched. So. Yeah, I, I'm just a bit sleepy. Um, so, I, I, you know, I, I'm not sure who all is streaming right now. Several people streaming, y'all could go watch, sesh, play with, whatever. I will see you all later. Bye bye. <laughs>